Utah Grizzlies are in Boise, Idaho at Central Lake Arena to take on the Idaho Stillheads. Grizzlies have standings points in 14 of their last 17 games and a good week of practice leading up to two big games this weekend. Uh, play smart and play our way. We know uh, each and every game here to finish the season is a big one, so we've got to come in strong tonight. we just got to simplify our game, get pucks to the net, uh, or be strong in the D zone, and... Uh, you know, we just got to outwork them. It's pretty simple. Yeah, you know, I think it's all about us right now and, uh, you know, our push for playoffs right now. we got to be uh, smart and uh, focused and detailed with everything we do. So, obviously, this is a good team. They're in second place in our division. So, um, we're just going to have to bring our all tonight. Grizzlies penalty kill has been pretty good as they are 19 for their last 19 in the last five games on the penalty kill. Grizzlies have also done a good job of limiting shot opportunities as they have allowed only 24.2 shots per game in the last five contests. PK has been great lately. Uh, you know, we're getting in shot lanes. We're just we're outworking their power play right now, so we got to continue to do that. Oh, obviously, the special team battles obviously a big one in every game you play. So, um, you know, try to stay out of the box. They got some skilled players over there, but obviously, uh, you know, on the penalty kill or stick positioning and then just work ethic is the most important part. Grizzlies get defenseman Taylor Richard back in the lineup. He missed the last two games and most of a third game against the Colorado Eagles last week. Richard leads all ECHL defensemen with 17 goals on the year. Just get traffic to the net, uh, battle for loose pucks, and try and capitalize when we can. The Utah Grizzlies have had some success against Idaho this season as they have a record of 7-4-0-2 against the Stillheads this year. A couple players to watch out for. Ryan Walters got 11 points, 7 goals, 4 assists against Idaho this season. Jake Marchman's got 10 points in 10 games against the Stillheads. Last time these two teams met was on February 19th when Joel Rumpel stopped 46 of 49 shots he saw in the Grizzlies' 4-3 win over the Idaho Stillheads. You can catch tonight's game on Utah's Classic Country, AM 1370. Tomorrow night's game is going to be on ESPN 700. Tonight's the first of a two-game series. The Grizzlies and the Idaho Steelheads face off at 7 p.m.